Franklin County Auditor Michael Stenziano is joining us now. And Michael, this new program, Mobile Licensing Dog Program, is really making it easy to get your license up to date. So that was one of our commitments, that we were going to take the office out into our neighborhoods and community. And so since dog licensing season started December 1st, we are committed in working with small businesses uh, that where residents will go to license their dogs. There's a recent change in the law that allows people to take dogs to eat with them on the patio at certain restaurants. Are they required to have a license? So the restaurant's not, uh, but we do encourage people to have uh, their dog's license. And so it's not required, but obviously we encourage it. It's required under state law to be licensed, but I haven't seen any establishment say, we're only going to allow you to come uh, enjoy a happy hour if the dog's also licensed. And I hear there's a couple puppy paloozas this year. So the Columbus Clippers have been a great partner, another county organization. And so they've hosted in the past puppy paloozas and they've had so much success, they're actually gonna have two. And so it's a chance for people to bring other dogs down to the ballpark and enjoy a game together. All right, Michael, thanks for coming in. Thank you. This has been a Justice Columbus Community Report. Thanks for tuning in. Candy Cane's presents cookies and songs. I am so sick and tired of your Christmas talk. Bah humbug. Bounce is celebrating all month long. Let's go, let's go. Santa's gonna be here in 48 hours. Ho, ho. A lot of people have got problems, especially during the silly season like now. I'm gonna light a Kwanzaa candle for you. All December long on Bounce.